Hey guys and welcome back. This is Micromus at MH Tutorials and today I want to tell you guys about the uh, 3D paint tool in Maya. What it helps you to do is after you create 3D objects uh, in Maya you can just uh, take a paintbrush so to speak and just uh, apply paint to them. Uh, for example, you modeled a street and you want some graffiti on a wall. You can actually put that on yourself. You don't have to texture it. Uh, you can adjust uh, certain shades in objects and so forth. But we'll just uh, get to it, okay? So I'm just going to click on a simple polygon object. I'm just going to pull that out in the grid, something like that. And I'm going to hit 5 for shaded mode, okay? Now this is the surface that I want to paint on, right? I'm going to go up to my drop down menu here. I'm going to select rendering. Going to go up to texturing and hit the option box for the 3D paint tool. Okay. That will pop up this menu here on the left. Now, before I tell you guys about these settings here, one thing you need to do is go down here to file textures, click on assign and edit textures. Otherwise, you won't be able to um, put any paint on it, so to speak. You can play with these settings as far as uh, size and so forth. I'm not going to mess with that right now. I'm just going to say, okay, assign and add a texture, right? Okay. Now, I already have a color set up here, so we're just going to give it a try. And as you can see, I can put some yellow on that, okay? Just going to go back, hit Control Z. There we go. Now, if you want to change your color, obviously, you just hit the color bar. I'm going to go for red like that, change the color to blue, like that, okay? Now that's that. Uh, as far as the um, the brush setup, you can uh, do a couple of things with that. You can uh, select the options here. This is a soft brush profile. This is more like a, an airbrush kind of thing to create effects. This would be more um, solid. You see that it actually looks like a blob of paint where if I switch back to that one, it's much more like a spray paint. Okay, I'll just uh, get the other side of that. All right, now another thing that's really important is uh, the radius. You can increase the radius. As you can see, it's huge. I'll put it back a little. Okay, right now it's very big. I'm gonna push that down a bit. And as you can see, it's much smaller, okay? Uh, well, that's pretty much it. Um, not too difficult. You can uh, play a little bit with the settings uh, as far as the stroke setting here, um, you know, and some other stuff. Uh, this is the basic uh, method of how to do this. So I hope that this was helpful for you guys. Got any questions, leave them in the comment section. And thank you guys for watching, as always. Thank you.